All right, got another one out here to play with it. I'm trying to get some of them down and run them some. Uh, I got so many, I have to keep them rotated, but I don't think everybody will recognize this one. It's the 66. Mm. Pretty nice old saw. It is a red light and it does still work. It still has red light ignition in it. <clears throat> so you'll hear this thing here in a minute whenever I'm cutting with it, popping and cracking and shit. The timing is not advanced on this saw, but it is limited. And it's the saw hitting the limiter. It's not detonating or anything crazy like that. I've, believe me, I've checked it. Um, this saw is stock also. Uh, it has a muffler cover on it, but other than that, it's it's all OEM stock saw. Muffler cover that I made. And that's, that's it. Still has a factory air filter. Everything. Alright. Let me, uh... We'll cut it off and get the phone in the tripod, get this all warmed up, and then uh, I think make a few cuts on this. On this log, if it ain't cut up. Oh no, I still got some left on it. We'll make a couple cuts on that. That's about the biggest thing I got laying out here right now. Besides that other log. And it ain't no bigger, I don't believe, so we'll just use this one. Alright, be right back. All right, let's see what it'll do.
Real good runner for a stock saw. I have no intention on doing anything to it. I'll leave it. I like it like it is. So. Anyway, these things are thirsty too. Just about out of gas. Thirsty old things. They get it done. Still. It's probably one of my favorite saws that I own. And I don't own many steels, but it's definitely one of the one of the good ones. All right, I think that's about enough. I'm gonna get my stuff put up before it gets dark and get in the shop and get to work. You guys have a good night.